أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته um, In this video, inshallah, we will be continuing book three of Islamic studies Madrasa course um, And in this video, inshallah, we will look at chapter four in the book On the topic of the prayer um, Or as-salah Okay, as-salah um, and inshallah, we've learned about Salah before in books one and two. Um, so some of this you will inshallah remember. Um, prayers are of course an important uh, part of Islam. Um, so Salah, the prayer, is the second pillar of Islam. It is the foundation of the religion and the best act of obedience. There are five prayers which Allah has prescribed for his servants. Um, and these prayers are the Fajr, the Dhuhr, the Asr, the Maghrib, and the Isha prayers. Allah's Messenger وسلم, said, If there is a river at the door of any one of you in which he washes himself five times a day, would any dirt remain on his body? When his companions, companions replied, None at all, the Prophet وسلم, said, That is like the five prayers by which Allah removes sins. Um, so this is a hadith, a saying of the Prophet um, from Sahih al-Bukhari. Um, so what's being said here is that the five prayers which we perform, they're like washing ourselves five times a day and removing all the dirt, okay? Um, and by dirt, we mean, I mean, you do wudu five times a day, so you're physically cleaner because you're doing wudu, you're performing this act of uh, purifying yourself physically with water, but you're also purifying yourself uh, spiritually you're cleaning your we're cleaning our souls when we pray we're cleaning our actions and our lives we're making ourselves cleaner in that way we're getting rid of the bad things through prayer through remembering Allah and this uh you know we're doing this five times a day so how how great an act salah is you know it also brings us closer to Allah where we're remembering him, we're stopping what we're doing during our day and we're taking the time to think about and remember Allah to do this action for ourselves, you know, to, to clean ourselves, to bring ourselves closer to Allah, you know, um, and when we're doing this good thing, we're not doing bad things, we're also removing the bad things, but because we're thinking about good things, we're not going to be doing bad things, inshallah. After the affirmation of Allah's oneness, no duty that Allah has prescribed for his servants is dearer to him than performing the obligatory prayers. Allah's Messenger وسلم, said, the merit of the congregational prayer, Jama'a, surpasses that of the indi individual prayer by 27 degrees. Okay, so when you pray in congregation, you pray together at the mosque or at home with your family. Um, this prayer is 27 times better than praying alone. And the Prophet وسلم, also said to perform the late evening prayer, so this is the Isha prayer, in congregation is equivalent to spending half of the night in prayer. And to perform the dawn prayer, so the federal prayer in congregation is like spending the whole night in prayer. Okay, so as we can see, by praying together as a group with other Muslims, sharing in this act of remembrance and this act of worship to Allah, we're able to make our prayers even more powerful. Okay, Salah is so important in Islam that we are ordered to perform it whether we are traveling or not, and whether we are in a state, a state of safety or danger. It is compulsory upon every sane adult Muslim. None of the five daily prayers, salawat, uh, which is the plural of salah, should be neglected. If someone is too ill to stand, then he should pray sitting. 
If he's too ill to sit, then he should pray lying down. Okay, so we must never forget to make our prayers. We should rush, insha inshallah, we should be eager, we should rush to do them when it is time to pray. Because we should want to seek to please Allah, to be thankful to him, to be closer to him by performing this act of worship, which is, you know, uh, one that Allah deems, you know, one of the most important ones to perform. You know, it's it's one of the, the pillars, you know, it's the second pillar of Islam. It's the second most important thing to do to be a part, to be a Muslim. Um, and it doesn't matter, there are very few circumstances where you would not be praying, so it is important, you know, and we should remember this as, as Muslims, we should remember our prayers, and we should make them five times a day, and we should be rushing to make our prayers at the right time, inshallah. Okay, so... Now there should be some exercises on this topic for you to complete, inshallah. Um, please take your time, do them properly, um, fill them in when you think you have the answers, and then inshallah have, a, have your parents, a teacher or another adult, um, check them for you. Um, so with that we finish chapter 4. Uh, inshallah in the next video we'll look at chapter 5. وعليكم السلام ورحمة الله وبركاته